All right, so I'm gonna give you guys a detailed look at this um, in the search for Luke Skywalker uh, playset. Yeah, I guess it's a playset <clears throat> with uh, two figures. One is Han Solo, and the other it's a just a rebel guy in the Tauntaun. And uh, this is uh, only available at Target. And uh, here's what the packaging looks like from the front. And here's the back. Uh, looks like this guy is a regular rebel trooper. That's what they're called. And here's Han Solo. And then the Tauntaun. And you're welcome to pause it and read that if you want. And on the top here. See some scenes from the movie. Cool. Let's get the, the set out of packaging. Alright, here's Han Solo with the Tauntaun and the Rebel Trooper. And uh, first I want to uh, show you the the box art, uh, the interior box art. It is race, so it's kind of cool uh, if you take out all these uh, uh, plastic bits. Uh, the cardboard, uh, there are a couple of sections. Well, this section right here and uh, this section, they're raised up. So it's kind of cool, it's got a tiny bit of a... 3D effect. So for anyone who are displaying them, uh, it is kind of cool to have them display with this uh, backdrop. So, so let's get on with the playset itself. Uh, this is such a great set. Uh, the Tauntaun with uh, Han hips. Uh, they're using the ball hinge joint now, so his, um, his legs can move outward. So he could definitely ride his Tauntaun without any problems and uh, here's the rebel trooper he is kind of cool too but uh, he's pretty much the same as the one they released uh, previously but I think now this one has soft good while the previous one didn't I'm not 100% sure but uh, let's uh, take a look at the Tauntaun itself we rotate him a little bit so you guys can get the front view of the Tauntaun there he is four nostrils and uh, the horns are there and uh, apparently the Luke um, the Luke Tauntaun has a broken uh, one side of the uh, of his horn is uh, broken so that would be the only difference between the two and the paint job is a little bit different but other than that, they're basically the same creature. And I believe this is the Tauntaun that actually died, and uh, with his uh, with his belly opened up. And uh, but uh, this thing, well, I'll show his belly in a, just a sec. Here it is, Tauntaun from the front. It's really, really cool. I am very happy with the set. For 25 bucks is definitely worth it and it is a target exclusive here's a side view the tauntaun with the han solo and the saddle is removable and here's the back side of the tauntaun it's a long tail and finally the other side As you can see, on Solo, uh, his hand is uh, holding on to the strap. And he is riding. Very, very cool. Alright, and here's the belly of the Tauntaun. As you can see, um, this piece looks to be added on, uh, but it is not removable and it is made out of hard plastic. So is I I tried prying it uh, with a um, screwdriver, but uh, it wouldn't come off. So most likely this is not meant to be to come off. Uh, but uh, it sure looks like that it could though. It would be cool if it does, but it doesn't. And uh, uh, let's go over articulation with the Tauntaun. Uh, head is on a ball. 
hinge shoulders a ball hinge and then nothing around the elbows or the wrist and then the, the hips are on a ball joint and the ankles are ball hinge and that's it for articulation for this tonton let's uh, take a look at the saddle itself nice looking saddle and again the straps seat all right let's take a look at the Han Solo itself uh, he has a removable uh, hat with goggles and uh, head is on a ball joint shoulders a ball hinge elbows a ball hinge and then the end of the glove there's a swivel and there's a swivel waist uh, uh, the bottom half it's uh, made out of soft goods and a belt with a working holster for his pistol and his hips are on ball hinge same thing for his uh, knees and ankles And here's Han Solo without his uh, hat on. Looks alright. Pretty cool sculpt. And uh, as far as the Rebel Trooper, there he is. Uh, same articulation as, uh, as Han except for the hips. The hips on this guy is swivel. And that's it. So he cannot ride on it. Uh, right on the tauntaun and he's got this uh, removable headgear and here he is without his headgear which is right there and a generic uh, figure he comes with a pistol which is already uh, held snugly in that holster and he's also holding a rifle and this uh, some sort of uh, uh, weapon or detector or whatever this thing is or a tracker or some sort of uh, item which I have no clue and here's the backside of the rebel trooper he's carrying a giant backpack and here's the back of uh, Han head gear and there's uh, Han's head gear and here's one last look at the Tauntaun the Rebel Trooper and also with Han Solo very very nice set it's definitely worth picking up um, now I don't know whether to keep the other Tauntaun since uh, it does have a broken horn uh, and uh, the color scheme is a little bit different and I don't know whether they're gonna release another box set uh, with uh, a new Luke attached to it but uh, currently the set is uh, pretty pretty good so uh, if you're going over to Target be sure to take a look and see if you could find this uh, set uh, I found it at the end cap there because they had a whole um, Star Wars display the end of the aisle and, uh, yeah so check that out definitely worth picking up and uh, let me do a size comparison all right from the back of the box looks like the Luke Skywalker's Tauntaun uh, has a brown a brownish color face while uh, Han Solo's Tauntaun has a uh, just a one color white face and uh, the horn is definitely broken on the left side uh, of the Tauntaun from the Luke Skywalker's Tauntaun while the Han Solo one has two nice horns 
But uh, other than that, other than the uh, the color difference and the horn, uh, they are basically exact same tauntaun. Um, hmm, I don't know whether to keep it or not now. It's kind of cool to have a broken horn, and uh, and it is painted uh, differently. But I don't know. Mm hmm. Yeah. And here it is. Tauntaun with uh, Han Solo standing next to Marcus Phoenix from NECA. Gears of War 3. And uh, yeah. There you have it. Mm, thanks for watching. Ooh. There you go.